Hey guys, just wanted to take a moment to explain marker blocks. They're a very powerful tool to be used uh, for the GM during their games. A marker block is accessed via the GM menu and the little map icon here. That will allow you to place a marker block down. When we place that marker block down, a couple of things are available to us here. I can fetch players, and this is primarily what I use them for throughout my games. If I've got players on another board or in a different part of this board, this will zoom their cameras to the current perspective in which my camera is set to at the time in which I place the marker block down. The other thing I can do is I can create it and convert it to a bookmark. Now, when I convert this to a bookmark, this becomes a quick uh, access point under the build menu and I'll show you that in a moment and of course then I can also delete the marker block. With the build menu as you can see here I've got a number of different bookmarks that are already listed under the Castle Ravenloft entry here and we can just click and go to any of these bookmarks at any time. Um, that's the, the, the chapel, we can go over here to the carriage house and so on. So these are, are preset positions in the game world that I would like the camera to go to. I use them myself for quick access to each of the locations, which of course I, I name by the map entry uh, in the module, and it just makes things a lot easier. The other thing that it will do is for the players, it enables the players if I just close this down, you'll see these when a bookmark gets created, like the great entry hall here. What it is, what it also does is it sets a these tabs on the slider, and these will appear for your players. You can click on this tab, and it will immediately set your green slider and your white slider, right? That's your hide and your camera to the same settings to which you place the bookmark. So by you positioning your camera and your hide levels at exactly where you want them, you place the bookmark, it puts a white tab there. Now when dealing with a complicated build, sometimes players get very confused over where they should be and what they should be looking at. You could summon them to this point and remind them if they fiddle around that they can just hit that white slider and get the view that they want. Um, it's also a good way to quickly, if you know you want to flick between the levels of a structure, uh, quickly flick around and, and maneuver around. Um, hitting tab will reveal your, your bookmarks that you've got placed in each of your locations. So that will also help you visually on the screen find the area you're looking for. Now, I hope this all helps. Uh, feel free to leave me any comments uh, down below and I'll answer any questions you might have. Great day, guys.